Dr. Elliott, I would like to know what the benefits are of digital mammography as opposed to the regular mammography. Uh, digital mammography is a way to capture images of breasts uh, on a computer so that there are no uh, plates or uh, films developed. Um, that way uh, the images are on uh, computer, you can compare them from year in to year out, and from a technical standpoint, uh, younger women who have denser breasts have a much better black and white contrast to their breasts, and that's the group of women who really uh, can benefit the most from uh, having a digital mammogram. Um, calcifications, uh, uh, the ability to go back and magnify areas and look in more detail uh, all come into uh, play when people have digital uh, mammograms. So the advantages of digital mammography are particularly uh, for younger women, better black and white contrast and a way to store their images uh, for better comparison year in and year out. With uh, digital mammogram, you don't really have to wait for the, any films to be developed. Um, on the computer, they pop up uh, immediately and actually a the computer uh, reads the mammograms and, and gives you a, uh, an initial impression as far as densities and calcifications. Uh, there have been national studies that have done comparing the advantages of analog and digital mammograms and the, the people who benefit the most. You can find things earlier, things that were missed on an analog mammogram rather than a digital mammogram are younger women. So women in the 40 to 50 age group. Um, the compression is the same on a digital mammogram as it is on an analog so that the technical aspect of how it's done is uh, exactly the same. Some women think that with a digital mammogram um, they can do away with the compression, but unfortunately it's the same process. Compress a breast and take a picture. The next generation of digital mammograms, which are probably less than a year away from being commercially available, is done in a digital format. It's recorded on a computer, but the software is completely different and a woman's breast is compressed in one dimension and a camera swings at an angle and takes five separate pictures at different angles and the software moves the breast tissue out of the way that's dense. So what's real and what uh, uh, could be invisible uh, really become um, noticeable and everything's about software these days. So. A mammogram machine used to cost $70,000. The newer ones are now $350,000, and the next generation are probably $600,000. So, but the technology um, is advancing so that those women whose breast cancers were invisible on mammography are becoming a smaller and smaller group.